Now, I'll have carte blanche to create the perfect society. My society. That's what you remind me of. An evil Mr. Rogers. What's going on? It's your main man. Demolition Man was a movie back in the 90s that was poking fun at PC culture. And many of the elements that were in the movie have come to pass. They can try to control how you think, the information. As you see with this tweet here, the shadow banning, certain topics that they didn't that didn't go along with the far left narrative, you were banned. You know, conservatives, red pill man talk, or toxic masculinity. You are fined one credit for a violation of the verbal morality statute. Fuck, Fuck you. So once you factor in. The Misinformation Bureau, which is an attempt to control thought, the tracking of small transactions like 600 bucks, which is another thing that Biden implemented, which is something to track what the, the poor or middle class is doing. Because nobody rich is sending somebody 600 bucks. Excuse the bug. That's got to be like a very rare instance that they'd send such a small cash transaction on cash hand. If ever. You can see the pattern. It's there. It's like Raymond Conto. Let's check, check out these tweets. This guy. Works at the School of Medicine. Not sure what his politics are. But his point of view did not fit with the far left. Therefore. He was on the trans blacklist. Let's go further down here. Let's check. This, this is the juicy part down here. Twitter denied that it does such things in 2018. Twitter is VJ, Gaddaddy, whatever, the head of Legal Policy Trust and Kayvon, or whatever these people's names are. We do not shadow ban, they added, and we certainly don't shadow ban based on political viewpoints and ideology. Hmm. What many, people, what many people call shadow banning, Twitter executives and employees call visibility filtering. Multiple high-level sources confirmed its meaning. Think about visibility filtering as being a way to, for us to suppress what people see to different levels. It's a very powerful tool, one Twitter employee told us. VF refers to Twitter's control over users' visibility. Visibility, It used VF to block searches of individuals, visual users to limit the scope of a particular tweet's discoverability. To block select users' posts, even from ever appearing on the trending page and from inclusion in hashtag searches. Click like on that. Well, we know that YouTube does that too. Certain topics, again, anything that has to do with man talk, you know, red pill, the manosphere, whatever you want to call it, definitely gets some shadow banning going on. All without the user's knowledge. We control visibility quite a bit. We control the amplification of your content quite a bit. See, they control that. Now, you guys complain about uh, they do it based on race, political affiliation. So they can do it. And they do do it. So it's right there. I'm not going to read through all that because you guys can uh, go check this out on your own. It's, it's, you see the lady's name, Twitter Files Part 2. So you can go to Twitter and go check it out. But it's real. Like I said, Demolition Man was right. Anyways, guys, go check this stuff out. So now you know it's true. When you, when you feel that certain tops are being shadow banned, they, they are doing it. If it's not a extreme left wing, then yeah, you get the filter. I'm going to wrap this one up, guys. 
a like, share, subscribe. It will be greatly appreciated. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Look, you can't take away people's right to be assholes.